Agents? Secret agents? Do we need them? Your mission is to get me a martini. A dry one. What is a manager? What is an agent? All will be revealed now. Right now. After now. this beep. Contrary to belief, we don't just shout at people. Generally, in the classical music world, a manager is someone who's supposed to shape your career. Have a vision, have a long-term vision, someone who you really have a trusting relationship with and with someone with whom together you can plan a long-term strategy for a long-term career. A manager is part business person, part therapist, someone you confide in. And they literally also manage different aspects. That's right, they manage your social media, your interviews, this, that. We can try to get you a record deal here. That's uh, right. And maybe you can commission this composer to write a concerto for you exactly. here. The manager does yeah. not get you concerts directly. Very often. Yes. Many managers do, but it's yes. not primarily their role. That's right. And in North America, for example, some states, a manager cannot be a booking agent at the same time. They are legally only allowed to talk then to a booking agent yes. and say, hey, would you like to book performances for my client and they would do that they however in europe the manager and agent role are merged that's why it's ambiguous because someone can be a manager and an agent at the same time an agent is someone who picks up the phone and gets you gigs they can be like your jerry Maguire. help me help you help me help you. We had a wonderful manager for many years called Elizabeth Weber. In previous times, she managed Billy Joel. Yeah. She did a lot of guidance for us. She became a very dear friend. From the very start, when she started managing us, she said, you know, my aim is for you to be able to manage yourself. She's the only one who can. one of the key things that I think we wish to impart. You will not leave school or win the competition and there will be a line of managers waiting out there. This is just not realistic. Whether you're lucky enough to find a wonderful manager or not, ideally you need to be your own manager. We have actually a dear friend, Bernard Keres. And Bettina Mena. And Bettina Mena. wrote Maynard. a wonderful book called be your own manager. I teach actually a course called Be Your Own Manager for classical musicians. You have to learn how to deal with things yourself. It's a kind of managerial way of thinking, which is very, very healthy. It's not like dry, oh, you have to do all these practical things. It's actually very creative. It makes you think about what do I really want in my life yes. and as an artist. <laughs>